Hello everyone, my name is Uthris, and welcome back to more RimWorld. Uh, we have a little bit of a visitor here, and he doesn't seem to be super excited about us uh, living in this new glorious land. Um, I'll draft that. So we're going to be sending um, a little bit of a force to go greet them and welcome them to our land of the dragon birds here oh we got him oh another good shot headshot all right Uthers, you're gonna you're gonna have to go man start kiting How is he alive right now? Headshot? Whole body, wake up addiction. Gunshot, right eye. Gunshot, torso. Left arm, pain, severe. They are definitely very injured. Keep, keep running, Uthers. Get him. In shock due to pain, health, a lot of old gunshot wounds here, and let me look at their bio here. They're pretty good at mining. Melee's pretty good too. Uh, ritual child, adulthood, beast slayer, incapable of caring or social. Um, the assassin. They are part of the uh, assassin rig. They are a pirate band. Um, I'm not going to recruit him. I'm not going to save him. Um, I will take his items. But uh, that's it. We should also strip him too. Why can't I speed up time? Okay, I can now. Yeah, this, this guy is not gonna make it. He's in shock. Bleeding is extreme. Um, yeah, they, they, they've been shot multiple, multiple times. And there's a bloody bear outside my, uh, my base. I don't like that. I don't know how dangerous those things are. Really, I have no idea about them. Hopefully it leaves me alone. I'm really hoping they leave me alone. All right, so progress on the base, guys, is moving on a little slowly. You know, just kind of getting there. Ooh, Mega Sloth. That's pretty cool. No clue what those things are. Uh, market value 700, meat amount 360, leather amount 120. Um, giant solitary herbivore with two giant claws warding off threats, long extinct after being wiped out by the natives of Earth's American continent. Interesting. So each of these rooms, guys, we're going to do uh, double beds on here, I think. Long term, if I take a look at the... Yeah, we're going to be doing double beds. Um, because they might want to shack up. I don't know. You know, Uthris is a bachelor surrounded by lady friends uh, on this save, it seems. Uh, with his, his best friend, Doggo. Which I still need to think of how to rename him. I have no idea if I can. Um, raw resources. That's fine. How's Uthris doing? What would we get? Old gunshot bruised? So we're just bruised. We're okay. A um, little bit of a pain, but honestly, he's, he's gonna pull through just fine um, after that slight annoyance that happened there. I'm gonna get rid of this wall and that door. I'm gonna move the door a little bit more central to this long, kind of big area space that's being kind of formed here. 
just fine. Oh, we're getting we're getting some steel. It looks like. We might have to end up digging out all this steel in the long term of things. Uh, but we're gonna maybe try and smooth out a lot of the surface too. Not sure. Let's take a look at our research tree or research. We're, we're researching batteries right now because eventually we do want to switch and provide power to everything. And um, I believe if we go to power, wind turbines are probably going to be what we use to do so. The only issue being that Well, actually, is there a, maybe a wind display here? Doesn't really give me an estimate of how much power it kind of foresees coming out of here, but honestly, I might be able to start generating power kind of up this way. Long term. So I'm gonna start with two wind turbines as our main power source. And then I'm going to dig out via mine here. A bit of a utility closet in a way. For some batteries. And I wanna put it in its own room so that it's a little bit secure, safe, and uh, away from the elements, right? So let's do power now. Insulator under shallow water. Okay, so we don't need that, we don't. terrain like that I guess not let me uh, let me cancel this I guess it would make sense that I have to like dig it out or something for sure how's our food situation not good um, I'll tell you now it's definitely not good so we need to think about doing some more hunting I think Orders, hunt. Not really seeing anything very well huntable in the area. I don't know what those things are, but I want to leave them alone. Uh, we can get this raccoon. That turkey's fine to go after. And another turkey. Looks like we got gobble gobbles all in our region, which is totally cool. I like the animal variety so far. Okay, so we're gonna try and get a squirrel and a couple turkeys. Um, we can also go ahead and do orders and harvest some more blueberries. Probably gonna be fine when it time for us to get food that way. Okay, we got the squirrel. Took out a turkey. I don't know, that was a raccoon. Maybe move closer next time. Okay, well, bye. So long. Go pick up. Oh, you shot that turkey. Oh, you shot it twice. Turkey is down. Turkey down. Just like that. Easy sauce. Yeah, we are really low on food. Outdoors is starting to get pretty warm. And that's going to be a bit of an issue 
long term with food storage. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm really sure by now everyone else who plays this game is just like, oh, wow, Luther's, you kind of, you're not doing great. And the answer is probably true. Probably true. You know, digging out, um, it's probably going a slower than just building up would have. But I'm actually okay with that. Long term. All right, let's look at some other production things that we can do. Electric tailor workbench, hand tailor workbench, electric stove, fuel stove, stone cutters table. Maybe we can throw that into here. Luther's gotten food poisoning from simple meal. Cause dirty cooking area. Okay, um, we need to. Um, I need floors. So we need to, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put some paved tiles down in the cooking area to help prevent that going forward. This is granite tiles. Um, I can smooth out some of the surface here. And a lot of this just raw dirt I'm gonna re be replacing which is standard concrete for now. Okay, we're, we're pretty close to being able to go ahead with building the beds. A group of travelers from Orbium are passing by, it looks like right now. Chop these uh, trees down real quick, too. is obviously kind of a quick and dirty patch um, when it comes to the long-term looks of things but uh, you know currently it's working it's looking fine um, things are progressing in that regard so I think we'll be actually okay for using concrete and stuff let's chop this stuff down need a lot more wood and lumber What do we need to do uh, fine meals? Requirements. Looks like we need uh, more veggie. More, more of a veggie thing, but uh, oh, what do we get? Minor, minor break risk. What's bothering you, man? George is not is not wooing to my my woo responses. I'm I'm trying real hard. Um, okay. Socials fine needs. Food is pretty low right now, but he's eating, so his food's fine. Mood is rising. Uh, big issue is just simply I think getting some lights and things in here. So if I go. Here, we're, we're, we're gonna solve our power a little bit. I need to run power into this area. If I smooth the surface, does that make it a wall 
that I can run power through. That's going to be a super important question for us as we move forward. Um, are you just looking at the sky? Yeah, I'm stargazing. Okay. Good. Just, just keep working in the dark mines, Uthris. Take a look at our research. We're about halfway done with batteries. Yeah, with Kaori doing research and cooking, she's pretty well tied up. Which is not really what I want. Like at all. And she's kind of the only one that goes out and harvests uh, trees too. We, we're really short on manpower. It's a big thing for us in the current stage of things. All right, storage, wooden stone cutter table. Uh, stone blocks, sandstone, granite blocks, limestone blocks. Okay, so we can make blocks. Uh, this until you have 50 granite blocks to until you have 50 limestone what's this what happens sad wander Uthris his sadness is because of poor mood. Final straw was ugly environment. Wow, I really don't like ugly things. Slate blocks. Do until you have 50 slate. I'm just making a huge queue because we might... We may end up needing this queue. We may not end up needing this queue. I don't know. Um, it's just kind of one of those things. Trucks of spacecraft are impacted nearby. You can deconstruct them to yield resources. Good. So we have some veggies. Come in, Kaori, making us a little bit of another meal. Um, we're gonna need more meat. A warg. I don't think you know if I if I know my fantasy wargs are not usually ideal to want to mess around with um, initially. You know, there's some chip chunks. I'm not really seeing anything to hunt. Which makes me a little sad because, you know, I, I, I need to bring, bring meat home. Alright, raccoons and... Alright, there we go. So we'll start hunting that stuff. Now what are these? These are boom rats. Either by deliberate genetic weaponization or unusual defense mechanism, these rodent-like creatures create a powerful fire starting explosion when killed. Don't mess with the... Don't mess with the boom rats. I now know this. Ooh, 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 look, look. We got, uh... The first bedroom done. Which is good. And I can flip this one around and try and get a bed in there. <laughs> we'll look however we can. These might end up being kind of our first beds in a big way. That'll hopefully really help their mood because if we can get beds... Vomit Uthris. Vomit Uthris. How do I clean? 
Is cleaning a thing? Yeah, everyone, everyone is set to clean, but no one's cleaning up my vomit. How dare they? I thought they cared about me. All right, everyone's sleeping. We're still really short on food. Basically, we're out of it. I'm gonna need to harvest some more plants. Is there any other, ooh, 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 ooh. Look at this, out here. We got, uh, can allow that. Some mules fell from the sky. I'm all for that. We need to start planting crops though, too. I can't keep relying on gathering berries and hunting all the time. I'm really gonna need some crops soon. Um, or else this is gonna be a never ending cycle of, of Nat having enough food. Uh, set owner, we're gonna go, Uthris gets this one. Now I don't think Uthris is in a relationship with anyone. So for now, we're, we're gonna assign them all different beds. Out of bed. Let's do. Um, let's do work, and you know, Shore doesn't really do a whole bunch of plant cutting uh, for us. That might be good for her to do in her downtime here. So let's do orders. Chop some wood. I'm gonna chop all those trees. I'm gonna need that wood anyways. Definitely need a lot of it. Nice, Uthrus has his own bed. Forming caravans, cover and shooting, order queuing. Drug burning, drugs can be useful, also can lead to harmful addictions. If you want to avoid drugs in a colony, you have the option of burning them at a campfire. Uthrus, Kyori, they're in bed. Transport pod crash. Oh, shoot. Um, looks like we got uh, a housewife. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> what is this? Uthrus uh, harem simulator? Okay. Um, what? Uh, log. No log. Gear. Okay. Social. Good at cooking. Good at medical. Intellectual can research. So basically a second uh, second person here. Um, I need to uh, Uther's white. Why are you standing on Kaori? That's a little weird. Set owner. No. We're gonna change this to medical. Draft. Rescue. draft so let's see she, she might join us uh, space refugee coming in Melissa Kiori providing some medical attention crack tended quality okay health okay it, it is is being worked on good that's what I want to see more people joining the colony we're gonna need a lot of them at the end of the day now she might not join still 
In which case, we might have to lock her up. Melissa has recovered and decided to leave. What? Why? No. Hold on. Why? Uh, I feel like I have been betrayed already. What now? What's happening? Screen was shaking. Chunks of spacecraft have impacted nearby. Okay, that's nothing new. It's pretty much every day at this point. Alright, good. Uh, let's do set owner. It's your. All right, Uthras buddy, you still going crazy out here? Probably. Probably for sure. And right, we have some food supply, so that's good. Uthras's bed is kind of taken now. Hold on. <sighs> no reachable, unreserved, enclosed prisoner marked bed in safe temperature. Nope. There we go. No, I, I need the extra person. I can't, you know, risk her leaving and sharing our current location. Um, you know, there's just, there's just no way. The Tasca people have arrived nearby. They were prepared for battle. Okay, so it's just one person. That's, it's not a bad bad thing that's a they're like a tribal person so i'll kind of let them get closer to be honest because when they get closer i can wake everyone up for now we'll keep keep everyone resting in restraints good all right they're beginning their assault we'll get uh Uthris and Sjord awake. Where are they at? Back! Got him. Easy. Herbal medicine. Easy. Alright. So we're, we're getting poked. We're getting prodded. We're making it through okay. Uh, who was our best? Social. It's Kaori. So when she wakes up, I'll have her try and talk to Melissa and be like, hey, look, you're not, you ain't gonna make it out there. <gasps> no! No, 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 no. What is going on? Get out there, guys. Put the ward down. No, 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 not the husky. Um, let's do architects. Right, right, and I think in furniture, is there an animal bed, I think? 
Minimal sleeping box. George, you're 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 offering up your your room. Oh shoot! I can't I can't. We don't we don't have that animal bed. Ward revenge. extreme it's I, I don't think it's going to survive to be honest uh, unreserved animal bed and safe temperature My dog. Come on, Kaori. Get over there. Oh no. Lola the husky bonded has died. Affect Kiori's mood. Why? Why did the? Why though? Yeah, you feed Melissa, that's fine. Take care of the warg. Rip. F's in chat. It's over. I'm no longer having fun now. And now I'm just extremely sad. doing out here like why why was she out here the rat broke her nose Jesus ancient okay where, where did that notification go Ancient danger. As Sierra draws near the ancient wall, a sense of forbidding overcomes her. She isn't sure why, but she feels that this dusty stru structure may contain great danger. So, I guess this here is uh, something that uh, I should probably stay away from for a long while. For a long, long while. So we'll get wooden door and stuff. If I do power now, and can I do a power conduit through these? I can. So that's how we'll we'll run power then. Kara is just so busy making food. She doesn't have time to research batteries. Our research is basically stagnated and stopped. How do I convince Melissa to join? Log. Recruit. There we go. 
Recruitment chance is 93%. Can we get rid of Lola, guys? Can we just like... My, my, my damn husky died. I'm sad. I'm gonna end the episode here. Um, if you guys are enjoying the stuff, feel free to subscribe. F some chat again for our husky. Our poor, poor husky. Um, if you guys want, you can go ahead and leave a like, leave a comment on everything that I'm doing wrong because I'm probably doing a hundred things wrong already. And we'll see you all in the next video. Thanks for watching.